The National Hurricane Center will be rolling out a new experimental cone during the upcoming hurricane season. The goal is to have a more impact-focused approach in communicating hurricane and tropical storm threats. This is what you're used to seeing. Instead, you'll be saying something more like this, with the alerts being the focus instead of the cone. The National Hurricane Center will be debuting a new experimental cone to relay important life-saving information for the 2024 hurricane season. All these colors here are showing you in this example here, this is not an actual storm, but an example of the different watches and warnings that would be in effect for that type of track. The goal is to have a hazards first approach where people see the tropical storm and hurricane watches and warnings first and the cone second. We want to flip it and have them start with the hazards. You know, how much wind is going to come in my community? Uh, what time would the wind might uh, arrive? You know, am I going to have heavy rain and flooding in my community? Am I going to have storm surge in my community? These are the fundamental questions that people need to be asking themselves during a hurricane threat. And the cone doesn't tell you any of that. Previously, the cone did highlight alerts, but only along the coast. It did not tell you much about whether your community would be impacted impacted or to what degree outside the cone. The bottom line, the new cone will relay the threats farther inland. Whether you're in the cone or not, if you're under one of these colored areas, that means that you are under risk of the impacts of a hurricane and it's time to take action. The NHC has been working with social and behavioral scientists for a few years developing this new approach. During this experimental phase, the NHC will issue it alongside the existing cone with a slight delay, letting people evaluate it and get familiar with it and give feedback of the changes.